Hi everyone, uh, today I'm going to be showing you my Seasons collection. It's a very short collection because I've only done up to two necklaces per season and one of them are already sold. <laughs> it's one of Spring's ones. If you go onto my blog site you'll see it, it's actually the very plain one. It was just a leather band with a turquoise rose on it, little polymer rose. So it was quite a plain one and that one's already sold. Um, I'm going to start with spring and then I'm going to work my way through to my favorite month, <laughs> my favorite season, sorry, which is winter. <laughs> so this one is spring in color. I try to use as many different colors as possible so that I could show all the different colors of spring. So that is all the different, I know it's very colorful. But you get people out there that are very colourful. I know quite a few of them and they absolutely love all the colour and all the different, the, you know, the different designs. So I made that for those people. And that is Spring in Colour. And that's for Spring. And then obviously, like I said, the other one was the Polymer Rose. Then I've got Summer. This one is a Summer Bouquet. Uh, it's the Choker. It's a, so it's a choker that, that would go around. Sorry, I forgot to tell you, the, the spring one was made with crystals. Um, let me just grab it again. So it was made with crystals and foil stones and gemstones and just wooden stones, different crystals. This was turquoise gemstone, freshwater pearls, abalone pearls, which for the fresh water abalone pills, I love those. And some more um, gems, gemstone and more crystal. So all just all different ones and then seed beads. Then we've got the summer bouquet. This one was made with um, you could say like fake pearls. I tried to make it cheap and not so heavy. With the pearls, I didn't want the pearls, you know, the, the pearls to be heavy because of the these things that are a little bit on the heavier side. So if you put heavy pearls and heavy beads, then it's going to be too heavy to wear. And this is a choker, and it's supposed to look like a summer bouquet of flowers, or so it's got the little and it's quite nice, it's got the little sticks in it. Okay. Then the other summer necklace is supposed to be a summer field. If you look in the blog, I actually put a picture that I use as motivation. Um, almost looks like the canola fields in Bedarsdorp. For those that live there that know me, know that I love those canola fields. They are so beautiful. If you're ever in South Africa and you want to see something beautiful, you go and check the canola fields when they are in bloom, which I think is around spring actually. But yes, so this is made with um, gemstone. Oh no, sorry, this is not gemstone. This is um, shell. These are shell. See there. And freshwater pearls and perspex slivers. And then tiger tail, which is there. And then the thing with the um, crystal in it. And that's what it looks like. Quite a long one, which is nice and dainty. Then we've got autumn. Autumn is my second favorite season. I keep saying that, I don't know why, but it's my second favorite season. And I think it's just because it's for winter and it starts getting cold. I love the cold, so this one is called bottled autumn. Autumn bottle, sorry, autumn bottle. Uh, this was made with crystal um, gemstones, these are man made gemstones, and foil beads, all different colors. I tried to get the colors of autumn because autumn can have so many beautiful colors the coppers, and the golds, and the reds, and the oranges, and stuff like that. And then I also put leaves. And some glitter into a bottle 
just for something different because I saw that a lot of people like to wear these little bottles with some people's ashes in and stuff like that so I thought it would be nice for something different to have these in the bottle with this one. Just can't drop that necklace because then, yeah, then the bottles have it. Okay. This one's also autumn. It's a autumn love choker, and it's made with crystal and perspex slivers and um, seed beads. And then you can see it's got the crystal bases in between. Also, try to use all the um, autumn colors. I really like. This one, I'm not really uh, usually a fan of, although I've been told that brown looks really good on me because it's my eyes are brown and my hair used to be brown. <laughs> and it was natural, so it should be long ago. But um, this is one of my favorite ones. I like the way it looks. Okay. And then we get to my favorite season which is winter. So this one is Blue Winter. It's also a choker. I did chokers because a lot of people say that I don't like to do chokers because I don't usually wear chokers because it feels like I'm being suffocated. Probably because I'm not thin. And, um, you know, so when I'm not thin, you've got quite a big neck and usually all the necklaces they make as chokers are like, uh, you know. So I just, I've stopped, I just stopped, I never like chokers. I suppose if I make it my own, don't know if I like it, but I know that other people love chokers, especially the thinner people, which is more power to them. Anyway, so this is, I think it's a sodalite, I could be wrong, I don't know, I've just gone blank on the stones today, so I don't know what's going on, but I think it's sodalite. And then I've got foil beads and crystals, and just glass and crystals and foil beads as they go along, and then the gemstones. Beautiful. Blue is also my favorite color, which obviously because my hair is also blue. Um, and then this one is the Snow Winter Necklace. So this one I tried to get the image of a snowy scape. If you look at the actual blog, you'll see the picture that I tried to use as motivation for it. It's got more white than blue in it. And it's crystals are used, so even this is crystal. And foils foil beads, full glass beads, just to give that snowy effect, and then seed beads and silver. And then I used a wooden um, tree that looks like it's surrounded by snow. So that is the snow one. Also another beautiful one that I think is stunning. Also because it's got blue in it. <laughs> <laughs> so that is my season's jewelry. Uh, I'm not sure if I will make more. Uh, I'll do it as I, as the, the ideas come to me or if I find something that I think would just look beautiful as a season um, piece then I will do so. But otherwise um, this will be it for now. Uh, I think I'm going to look at other, other um, collections and also I'm very into my bohemian collection which I love doing there's a few ideas that I have for that one as well and I'm also starting to make the men's necklaces at the moment so um, I'm just checking that out as well as the first time that I've been making for other men I usually I make for my husband but not for other men because you know your husband has to wear what you, what you make him <laughs> otherwise he's in big trouble <laughs> so anyway but thank you very much for watching me, for all the people that view my videos and um, for liking them and for my family that also are far and wide that like to watch just so that they can see me. <laughs> Hello, <laughs> Shani Wally, Chris, Daddy, <laughs> everyone. <laughs> so, hello. If you like the video, please give it a thumbs up 
and if you haven't subscribed already please click the subscription block i will really appreciate it and if you click the notification bell you will be informed when i upload a video again and then also all my social media will be in the description block below and um, you can go and look on like my blog site and that i've amalgamated my two blogs um, i've merged them together so that um, i don't have two blogs to write to um, so everything is on the one blog at the moment so you'll see if you go to the blog that says on dean lorenz then you will find it under a little tab drop down tab as a video with the different things so you'll find it there. So I hope you enjoy your day further and keep your crystal on and your sparkle strong. Goodbye.